Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich, and we are literally 17 hours away, 45 minutes and 35 seconds away from history in Canada. It's true. And the cannabis stocks have been going wild, and we have some breaking news. Aurora Cannabis introduces CBD, CBD oil cartridges for vape pens. This is the breaking news right now coming out just on the wire. Aurora Cannabis Inc. today announced it has received the necessary compliance verification from Health Canada to re release for sale its innovative high-potency vape-ready CBD oil product line. <laughs> Getting in the CBD game. Launched today under the brand Aurora Cloud, the first products released contain over 550 milligrams of CBD and less than 30 milligrams of THC making them only vape-ready CBD products legally available in Canada. This is the first of a broader line of full-spectrum cannabinoid-based vape-ready cartridge products the company intends to launch in the future. As the only licensed producer to have successfully navigated the technical and regulatory challenge required to bring this product to market, Aurora will initially focus on distribution to medical patients. It is anticipated that Aurora Cloud products will soon be available to the wellness segment of the adult use market being produced at Aurora Mountain one of the company's two EU GMP certified production facilities Aurora also intends to introduce Aurora cloud products to international markets where these products are or will be permissible what does Terry, Terry Booth the CEO of Aurora have to say being the first LP to launch a vape ready CBD rich product for the rapid growing medical and wellness markets reflects our continued leadership in developing and rapid commercializing product innovations, providing us with an important competitive advantage. Love it. We identified a significant unmet market need and our technical and regulatory teams rapidly executed on this opportunity. We are very proud of this accomplishment by our teams and will continue to leverage our leadership in executing our strategy to develop a robust portfolio of high value ad margin, higher margin products for all markets and jurisdictions that we participate in. Dr. Shane Morris, Vice President of Product Development and Regulatory Affairs, added, Product innovation and the ability to successfully navigate the regulatory landscape are core capabilities required for competitive differentiation and future success in the rapidly evolving cannabis markets. Aurora Cloud was developed with the domestic and global medical wellness markets in mind, and we are intent on rapidly introducing these products to other jurisdictions. Aurora Cloud was developed in response to very significant and unmet demand in legal medical cannabis market to provide more flexibility in how cannabis can be consumed, production of Aurora Cloud is based on proprietary extraction and processing techniques, delivering a vape-ready cartridge that can be used with a generic 510 threaded vape battery pack, one of the most commonly used versatile formats available on the market today. The first batch of Aurora Cloud cannabis oil cartridges are made with non-gamma iridated award-winning CBD flowers and will initially be sold in one gram units priced at $75 per unit, 52 50 per unit for compassionate pricing patients. Like all Aurora products, Aurora Cloud cartridges come with publicly available independent laboratory analysis reports on cannabinoid potency, terpene profile, and pesticide and contamination screening. Love this company. Love this news. What do you think about this news? If you like this news, smash the like button. Comment down below. Share the video everywhere. Aurora Cannabis breaking $15 yesterday and breaking more news. And bam, they got even more news. Look at this. Aurora Cannabis books 20.6 million gain on their TGOT investment. Last Friday after the close, the Green Organic Dutchman reported that strategic partner and investor Aurora Cannabis had opted not to exercise warrants that would be allowed to boost its stake by 10% at a 10% discount to the stock price. The warrants were originally set to expire on September 2nd, but the two parties agreed to extend the expiration to October 12th. Aurora and TGOD had struck a deal in early January with Aurora agreeing to buy 33.33 million units at $1.65, picking up common shares along with 16.67 warrants at 
Aurora also gained the right to purchase up to 20% of the company's production from its two pending facilities in Ontario and Quebec. Beyond the 8% option that Aurora declined to exercise, the company could have bought additional shares that would have given it control of the company upon TGOT attaining certain milestones. After the purchase in January, Aurora invested in the TGOT IPO, picking up an additional 6.34 million shares at $3.65, along with 3.17 million warrants at $7. Not only did Aurora choose not to invest further in TGOD, but it has also moved to reduce its holdings. According to final fi filings with CDI.ca, Aurora disposed of over 5 million shares last Wednesday and Thursday that were disclosed after the news that the company had let the option expire. Unexercised. So you can see here, they sold 5 million shares, the total proceeds of 28.977 million at an average sales price of 5.732 represents a profit of 20.63 million based on the first purchase at 165. The company still maintains all 19.84 million warrants as well as 34.62 million shares. TGOD stock has been under pressure lately but still trades at a premium to the May APO price IPO price of 365. What do you think about this news? Remember, Risk TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live. This is why TGOD stock has fallen because of pressure that Aurora was selling, but they've got some big news. They are getting very heavily involved in the CBD cartridge, oil, vape pen industry. You know your boy Rich is very deeply involved in the CBD industry, and I think this is big news. What do you think about this news? Comment down below. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Aurora Cannabis on fire. What do you think about this news? Let me know. Holler at your boy. This is your boy Rich, and I'm out. Peace.